Welcome, this is the Energy Vibration Reading for the Sagittarian Sun, Moon and Rising Sign. It is the third week of August 2017 and we begins from the 14th until the 20th. It is the week of the it is the week of the tower and it is in fire energy this is wonderful whatever the energy vibration the tower is coming in to clear certain things out of your life and to clear a certain aspect out of your life so whatever the situation is uh, the tower is coming in to clear the zodiac energy is going to be fire for whatsoever reason whatever is coming in it is going to be a week of uh, positive energies for you um, you are the only one that has gotten the star this is a new deck that I'm using and this new deck is the um, deck of the um, hobbits the hobbits the hobbits okay it's a deck of the hobbits and this is good so whatsoever is happening in this week um, it's like we're working with the dwarf the little peoples because they do exist um, to um, try out and work with because this was in another lifetime than this lifetime this dimension of this hurt so whatever is happening let me go ahead and give you the messages before I'm going to go in and explain certain aspects and certain things to people um, whatever is happening you have the energy of the king of Pentacles in your week the king of sword I wish it was the king of Pentacles for you guys because he will be much better you have the energy of the king of sword and the four of swords on Friday you need to have rest whatever is happening um, you have the king of sword in this week whoever is this king of sword he needs to pay you some money okay and he's been and you know it's, it's there is a loss that is going to be coming in and you need to have balance whatever it is uh, um, a loss of miskin friendship it doesn't really matter because if it's a loss of friendship it wasn't a friendship in the beginning whoever this king of sword is he's in the middle of your week okay and you have to deal with this queen of cups the queen of cups and the king of pentacles so your focus is going to be the energy of the queen of cups in this week your weakest governed door this king of sword whoever this king of sword is is an annoying person if you ask me it's a very annoying person let's look and see whatever else is going to come out a magician with the ace of Pentacles is wonderful magician with the ace of Pentacles, victory and success over the king of sword oh thank you thank you thank you victory and success over the king of sword thank you Jesus thank you thanks to the dude thanks to everyone out there thanks to my guardian angels whatever what was happening because you know whatever the situation is let's look at it um, but anyway yeah whatever the situation is when a week is governed or the energy vibration of uh, um, a king or a queen that is not positive for a lot of people and do you know why the reason why that is not positive is because whoever this person could be carrying negative or positive energies okay so you need to understand this light is a bit too close you need to understand what is happening okay and whoever this person was and whatever the situation was uh, but this energy vibration of this person you are going to see that the devil the devil the ten of sword you know on Sunday whatever the devil the ten of swords but <clears throat> whoever this person is uh, you are going to be victorious and successful over them and good for them because you're a fire sign person you're a fire sign person and uh, there was a situation who this queen of cups was involved with this fire sign person and now you're seeing clarity over a situation now you're seeing clarity over a situation so whoever this queen of cups is whatever lies or whatever she was telling there is clarity over a situation and obviously she was not being honest and now you're seeing clarity over the situation with this queen of cup whoever she was okay so you are the first one who have got the energy vibration of the star the energy vibration of the star and with um, a celebration so this is going to be good whatever is happening on Saturday you'll have the energy vibration of a star and a celebration no matter what is happening on, on, on Sunday let's look and see what is going to be number one energies and number L number 11 and number one and number 11 is here number three is here so one three and eleven 
The devil is 516. Number six is here. Number six is here. Five and five and five. Oh my gosh. Um, you have the scare. Oh my gosh. So, okay. There's a lot of numbers for you guys out there. Okay, you have one, 11. You have three, three, three. You have five and you have six. One, three. Five, six, eleven. Okay. So okay, let's let, let's look and see what's happening in this week. Happy, 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 joy, joy, joy. You have the ace of coins. So darlings, and you brought it in in a very intellectual way. However, you got this, you baked a very good cookies because you have the ace of coins. <laughs> I'm loving this for you guys. So what is whatsoever is happening in this week oh, with this Queen of Cups? And you've seen clearly about the situation. There's someone who is a Cancer Scorpion or a fish who has been lying, and whatever she has been doing, well, it's finally over. Okay, whoever she was, you're seeing her clearly now. You're seeing her for exactly who she was. So, so you Sagittarians, be open and stand up and look at this person because this week you're going to see them for who they are. So you have the ace of coins and you brought in this ace of coin like with magic uh, you did something and you really work your magic so whatsoever that was happening you work your magic and you got this ace of Pentacles and in a good way you work hard for it you work very very hard for it so this is good whatever is happening this is good this is good okay on Tuesday which you will have a coin the earth sign on Tuesday so Monday and Tuesday is the energy vibration of the hurt so there is balance okay you have the energy of you leaving something behind so whatever hardship whatever hard times you have gone to whatever hard times emotionally uh, imbalanced from your financial situation you're leaving that behind it is in the reverse you're turning your back on it and you're leaving it behind and you're looking forward to something much more pleasant uh, to do something that is much more good for you to do something that is going to bring you to a place of happiness and joy within yourself so whatever hardship whatever um, um, hard things you were going through you are going to leave this behind and move on to better waters better shores better shoreline better sea line okay so this is going to be good in the middle of the week as I said and I was so upset when I saw this energy you have the king of swords whoever this king of swords is it could be an Aquarius in Libra or Gemini whoever this king of swords is it can be a king or a queen of swords she and this person and why you know sometimes when the king and queen um, it can be it's affecting the king is affecting some people and the queen is affecting some people but whoever these sort people are they can be Aquarius um, Libra or Gerani whatever the situation you're going to be victorious over them thank you thank you thank you because you Sagittarian people I mean you're wonderful people I mean seriously that these people but yes we have to change our and clean our energy vibration and we have to work it out with so many people who are we have had contracts with whoever is this king of sword you're going to be a winning a victory you are going to be having a victory and you're going to be moving away from him or whoever it is it has nothing to do with justice it has something to do with someone who is just vindicted okay so whoever this king of queen was is a vindictive person who has been in your life and now you are victorious and successful over this person you're moving away from away from this person so be aware of whatever is happening you have been victorious and triumphant over this person thank you thanks to the angels and guide because I saw it come up and I was like okay I've been having these doubles whatever it is there is a information because I'm working with the spirit guides and also the interject galactic and beings and cosmic beings there has been double energies coming up there is the energy of the five of cups is 
coming out the five of cups twice so there's going to be a loss there's going to be a loss of something but there's going to be something that is going to be gained in the end whatever the situation is it's going to be a loss whatever it is um, um, and it, it, this is a loss of friendship and if you have lost a friendship or if people don't speak to you anymore and if people um, you know don't speak to you because of a situation that um, to someone else then they weren't good in the beginning anyway so whoever these people are whatever the friendship you're going to lose it was not a friendship in the beginning people do not lose friendship people have friendship for a lifetime so if people stop talking to you and whatever friendship there was it has lost it was not in the beginning a good one okay so whatever the loss of friendship that you're going to have on Thursday it's okay because in the beginning it wasn't a friend in the in the first place whatever the situation is it's not a friend in the first place so whatever that you're going to be lost because look on Monday you have gained the ace of Pentacles in a good way okay whatever your intellectual is you have gained the ace of Pentacles on Monday in a good way okay whatever has happened the five of um, the five of coins whatever financial hardship or whatever hardship you were having you're turning your back on that on Tuesday and on Wednesday what you're doing is that whoever this king of sword that was trying to rule your life uh, you're gonna be victorious over him you know do it duh, bye you know that sort of a thing and whatever the friendship was if you have lost the friendship okay it wasn't a friendship and a lot of people are going to lose friendship on Thursday people let me tell you something about friends friends is friends for life okay if you choose to be French and have friendship with people then it's a friendship for life this is a situation that you need to understand that um, whatever you're going to lose it wasn't a friendship okay so if people um, stop talking to you and people are not it wasn't a friendship move on someone else better and new is going to come in your life whenever we go um, we're going to look at Friday and Friday is going to be the 18th. Friday is going to be um, the 18th. Friday is a good day um, because I started my journey. I started my journey on Friday the 18th um, when I started writing my blogs. So, and we have the energy of the Four of Swords. So Friday is going to be a rest day for a lot of you people. Whatever is happening, Friday is going to be a rest day for a lot of people. And this is going to be good because you have the energy of the Six of Coins. So whatever is happening, this energy of the Six of Coins is here. Friday is going to be a very restful day. So, okay, so we're going on. So what is happening here? Yeah, and Friday is a restful day. And you're going to have the energy of... Uh, um the um queen uh, the, the 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 six of pentacles six of pentacles is gift coming in to you on friday so whatever that is happening there is going to be a lot of gifts coming in on friday so this is going to be positive this is going to be good on friday there is really little gifts coming in on friday so this is going to be positive and good so okay saturday congratulations this is the first time i'm using this deck and the you know, I've always told you, Sagittarians, that you're such lucky people. Yes, you are lucky people. You have two times the star of David, two times the star in this um, deck, and you have a celebration. So, congratulations, um, you guys. This is wonderful. Whatever the energy of the star brings, there is a huge celebration that is coming in. Your wishes and dreams are coming in on Saturday. So whatever that has been happening, you are victorious, um, triumphant over the King of Swords and uh, um, you know whatever the friendship was that you lost on Thursday, there was no friendship. But on Saturday, you are having. Um, your wishes and dreams are coming true and you are having a great good celebration whatever is happening you're having a great good celebration and this is really 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 a positive energy and I'm loving whenever the star and the celebration coming up because it is obviously that your wishes and dream are going to be coming true whatever is happening your wishes and dreams are going to be coming true this is this is really 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 a positive week for a lot of people out there um you Sagittarians always feel as if you know um you know you're not lucky but you're so lucky and, and not even knowing it and not even using the energy vibration because you know if a Sagittarius doesn't have anything in their life it's their own their own um, um personal experience that is holding them back 
you know this is wonderful so it's going to be peace and tranquility whatever the situation that is happening it's going to be peace and tranquility on Saturday tranquil visionary progress and it, it brings also trust and faith and it is, it is really nice because whenever the star energy comes up it's always about trust and faith and you know this is a, this is really nice it show us the light to the end of the dark tunnel that we had been and the life after the darkness and it becomes it gives us also freedom and navigation whatever we might be wishing for and looking for and this is what i'm always because this is a new deck this is a new deck so um sometimes the decks the, the um um meaning of the decks are different so it gives the same energies and the same there whenever the star comes upright it is always that your wishes and dreams are coming true it's always a pleasant time a time of tranquil and peace a time of celebration that is coming in and people are going to be celebrating a lot of people out there will be celebrating whatever it is you're going to work with your girlfriend because there's new work there's whatever whoever you have lost or whatever you have lost on thursday let it go because it was not really a friend or that sort of a thing so so on Saturday the energy of the star comes out on Sunday as I've always said to you people and always listen on Sunday you have the energy of the the dragon the fire dragon is you know the fire dragon is coming to burn the house down and everything down and this is the energy of the devil in this card is the fire dragon so this is the other deck so the uh, yeah the, 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 the devil would be the fire dragon the dragon that you know carries the fire and he's burning down a whole city out there and you know and, and this is this is the energy vibration of the king of swords because he didn't get his own way because he didn't win so he on Sunday is, is sending a lot of message and the stab in the back and you're standing there so cute and beautiful and you have no ideas what people are talking and and doing against you so you know guess what you have won your wishes and dreams are coming true so whatever the situation is you have won and your wishes and dreams are coming true so whatever this king of sword wants to do let him go on and blaze this fire like as if it's a dragon and burn down the whole city because burning down the whole city is not going to affect you all the lies he can tell and all the backstabbing and all that was happening whatever you have your ace of pentacles um your wishes and dreams are coming true so whatever this man has to, uh, has to say it's not going to affect you in any way so this is going to be good so you know just release whatever is going on here because sometimes uh, and and this is going to be on Sunday so whatever is happening whoever is gathering together and that sort of a thing just just leave it because what you're going to realize is that whoever this this devil is and it's dragon and, and and people are backstabbing you and this sort of a thing let them go because you know they are sitting down there using their energies and that sort of a thing and you are moved on to a new place to another thing in your life and it is going to be um, very um, um, fulfilling as we move forward um, as I said in the beginning of the week you have the ace of um, Pentacles and you have the star so your wishes and dreams are coming out you're going to be celebrating this is going to be wonderful you have the energy of the five of coins in reverse and you're moving and uh, moving and walking away from whatever that was happening to you and you're going to see that, that you're manifesting money in your life but yet still your wishes and dreams are coming true in the second half of the week you have the energy of the devil and you're been stabbed with the ten of swords and uh, you know at the end of the day you're going to just take a rest and you know you are going, to, are going to just open up and accept the gifts that are coming in to you because whatever is happening you know people think okay they're speaking bad you know whenever people lose something they're speaking bad about the other person so what is going to happen you're just going to take it easy and take your little gifts that is coming through whatever is happening the five of cups is here twice so you're going to be losing friendship you're going to be losing friendship it, but you know again I'm, I'm saying to you people if you think or if you lost a friendship it wasn't a friendship in the beginning whatever the situation is if you thought that you lost something or a friend it wasn't for you in the beginning so leave it alone you're foremost focus is that whoever the Aquarius the Gemini or the Libra that is in your life that you know you're, you're gonna let it go you're gonna just no 
no no no and you're just gonna let it go and um, move away from it whatever that has been happening with the queen of whoever this queen um, this a uh, cancer scorpion or um, Pisces person was you're going to see the truth about them the truth is going to come out about them whoever they were okay we're working with the chakras let's see what is the energy for the chakras in love um, on Thursday there is going to be it's not really heartbreak it's just going to be that you lost friendship whatever that was if it was a friendship you wouldn't lose the friendship what is the messages that is coming out throat chakra okay throw chakra so you people should speak the truth whatever is coming out the base chakra really we're called, talking about the, the, the Sagittarians and the sacred chakra so you're working with three chakra you um, Sagittarians you're working with the throat chakra base chakra and the sacred chakra okay whatever the message was was with that that you're working with the chakras sometimes um, some people need to balance and uh, um, because you're a lucky um, you're a lucky zodiac person you need to sometimes balance three or more chakras so that your luck can come through what is the message from the e oracle for you guys <laughs> Blixie. <gasps> Bazinga, Bazinga, okay, Bazinga. Somebody else got Bazinga, okay, whoever that person was. Bazinga for you, Sagittarians. You're lucky people. Bazinga, well, well, well. Don't you get it going on? Now the time is revealed in the sweet taste of fabulous you. You have hit your mark. Go on, take a victory lap. Pop a cock. Let's get the sparta started. Congratulations are lining up at the door. Okay. Wow, isn't this really wonderful? Well, well, don't you get it? Don't you got it going on? Now is the time to reveal the sweet taste of fabulous you you have hit the mark go on take a victory lap pop a cork let's get the party started celebrations are lining up at the door wonderful 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 so this is this is this this is wonderful whatever is happening a lot of celebrations will be lining up at the door and I can see this because you're victoriously successful you're victoriously successful over um, this uh, this um, king of sword whoever it is you're moving away from him you're victorious and successful over him and you're really really moving away from him whatever is happening you're moving away from him okay I'm asking the angels in the guide for um, ask your questions so the angels can give you an answer for whatever question that you'd like um, the answer to opportunities and that is so the true because this this reading it's really a reading of opportunities a lot of opportunities are about um, to come your way and you know ask people for help ask people for help a lot of opportunities are about to come your way ask people for help whatever is happening in your life ask people for your help positive growth and expansion is on the horizon for you this opportunities may bring with it inspiration and insights or it could be the chance you have been waiting for to take action and on ideas you already have you may be seeking the manifestation the chance to create changes in your in your career buy or sell a house or being romance in bringing romance into your life whatever your desires your angels are about to open a door of possibilities for you a step right through so this is a wonderful you have really two very nice cards uh, um, here and it's going to be wonderful because opportunities is positive growth and expansion is on the horizon for you whatever opportunities may bring with it inspiration and insights or it could also be a chance that you have been waiting for to take action on ideas you already have 
you may be seeking the manifestation the chance to create changes in your career and this is going to happen for you guys so this is going to be a positive so whatever your your your, your question was the answer is going to be yes opportunities are coming into you and this is going to be positive okay so I want to say to each and every person um, have a wonderful wonderful um, um, week please remember to go back and listen to um, the monthly reading because uh, there is five weeks in this month and we're at the third week uh, and I want to say namaste until next time